this is a quick video tutorial on how to set up Becca Buddy for WordPress on a GoDaddy shared hosting account. Becca Buddy is a really comprehensive backup plugin for WordPress that can handle uh, both local and offsite backups as well as restores and migration to a new host. But by default, Becca Buddy doesn't play well with uh, GoDaddy shared hosting accounts. This is due to limitations on shared hosting accounts. If you will run a backup process with the default settings, it will fail, as you will soon see. So this is a fresh backup body setup with all the default settings still in place. As you can see, I still have uh, the notification here that I need to configure the backups. This is a network setup. I will not press the get started here. I will simply go through network settings to set up backup body. Don't need that. So backup body and settings and if we will go to the advanced settings you will see I uh, will scroll down uh, basically the uh, major issues will be with uh, the zipping capabilities because by default backup body uses the exec function which GoDaddy doesn't support on shared hosting accounts I will demonstrate it by running a default backup with the default settings so you can see the error message and then we'll go back to uh, this section and verify the settings that we need to change so let's click here on backup and I'm gonna skip the setup wizard and I will choose a full backup basically now the backup will start to run with all the default settings uh, this process can take a while, so I'm going to pause the video now and I will resume as soon as the error message will appear. Okay, so we're back and as you can see, we now have a red X sign next to the zipping file and we also have an error message saying that the backup archive size was not increased in 30 seconds and that means that the process has most likely timed out. So uh, let's go to the settings tab and to the advanced settings tab and if we scroll down to the settings we'll now make the adjustment needed to fix the problem. So the first thing will be to choose force compatibility and now let's click on alternative zip and we can keep the rest of the settings just as you see here multi burst or single step maximum time per chunk 30 seconds gap between zip build burst 2 seconds minimum content size sorry about that minimum content size will be 10 megabytes and maximum content size will be 100 megabytes and we will also check those two check boxes and click save Now let's go back to backup and click on complete backup again. And we will let the backup process run from start to finish. Again, I will make a pause here because it will take a while. Okay, and we're back. And as you can see, the zipping operation has been completed successfully. And so does the rest of the backup process. And now instead of an error message, we see this little green check mark uh, that says that we are all good. So this is basically how to fix the compatibility issues between Backup Buddy and GoDaddy Shared Hosting. And if you're interested in GoDaddy Shared Hosting, then you can click on the GoDaddy link just under this video player and receive 30% discount on your purchase. Yeah, 30% discount on any new service with GoDaddy just by clicking on the link under this video player. Just enjoy it. See you next time. Bye-bye.